Nathan, commiserations, the unbeaten one comes to an end. I guess this is the last place you wanted to come to an end. Yeah, look, just f I understand the importance of the game and, and stuff, you know, local rivals haven't played 16 years and stuff, and I understand, so congratulations to Watford, you know, Watford scored sc 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 goals today, but you know, there was a lot of context to it. Um, we've put in big, big shifts, last four games we've been three away, West Brom, Norwich, Watford here, and then QPR at home, we remained unbeaten in three, got seven points, that's a good haul, so we, we can't forget that. Today we got decimated by an illness bug, you know, we lost Henry Lansbury, we lost um, Luke Berry, we lost Dan Potts, even though they were on the bench, even though they were they were actually named, they, they didn't come out, they were, they were thing because we were decimated by it, Sonny Bradley decimated by it, so he was right through the squad, and we show today, we, we looked lacklustre, we looked at, you know, we've given away goals that we never give away, first two minutes we don't mark in the box, but look, again, context to it, and then we've given, given the ball away, and it's only happened three times since I've been here in six years, once at Derby away and twice today, so a lot of stuff that weren't us today, so look, congratulate uh, uh, Nor uh, Watford today, but you know, there's a lot of context to it. Really disappointed, really gutted. I, I apologise to the fans for what they've had to go through today, but look, we've, we, we've you know, we, we're given plenty to, to go, so it's not like we're, we're well in credit so we can do that, because it is the last place we wanted to come to, but it's, it's a lot of context to that result today. Was the early goal a shock to the system? Well, it's just settled them. They're under real pressure, you know, they've They've got Premier League players, Premier League everything um, in terms of that. So we wanted to start well and, and get the thing. And they, they needed something and we gifted them first. I know didn't clear the ball. And then we don't mark, get pulled over too easy and they score. And then, you know, second goal's a real killer because it's, we, we just haven't done the basics well. You know, really haven't. And we've, the ironic thing at, at 3 0, we've probably had three of the best chances of the game. Elijah's had a great chance, uh, Gabe Osher's had a chance, Backstick, and then Ka uh, uh, Carlton's had a chance. So we've actually had probably, probably three chances each that they've taken and we haven't taken ours. And looking at um, the third goal as well, probably comes at a bad time because you start the second half one. We did, and we want to get front-footed and stuff, but we don't. And, and look, we, we never, as I said, we've only given the ball away three times that has led to conceding, and that's three times in six years. And that was Derby away, as I said, and twice today. So it's it's a little bit unfathomable, really. But look, that's what happens sometimes. And it says a lot of context. We, we put in big, big shifts. They went away and put in big, big shifts. You know, I've, um, uh, but today, we weren't. We, we, we were never really, really... Uh, ourselves and that's that's the thing that disappoints me your thoughts on the red card I I yet to see it but we ask for discipline because at the end of the day the game's done and it doesn't doesn't need to give the referee a decision and it's not just now it's three games you know and that's the thing that kills us and with us being ill and Reese Burke being injured it, it thing and he's just come back from injury so it's absolutely stupid in what he's in what he's done so you know I, I'm really disappointed it's a bad day it's a really really bad day and and you know, sometimes people lose their head and they didn't need to do that because it, it's not just today, it's a knock-on effect. Does that come from the element of frustration of, of, of losing the game and, and how the game was? Yeah, but trust me, I was, you know, I was frustrated. I was getting called absolutely everything. I didn't go and punch someone. I didn't go and do something stupid that, that cost me in the future. And that our players can't do that. They have a responsibility to the football club, not just to take law into their own hands. And that's stupid. He's a young player. He's a young player that's just come back from injury, you know, and trying to find his way in the game. So it's disappointing. Does the, the manner of the game itself make it any difficult to, to get this out of your system? No, no, no. Look, we'll get it out of the system. It's a defeat. We have to move on from it. The goal difference we don't like in, in, in terms of that. And it's, it's, it's what we didn't really want, you know. But there's real context to it. When, you, when you're decimated by four in, on, in the morning of the game, you have to change the team. You have to change certain things that you do. You know, and, and that's not ideal. And, you know, we had to all right be through. We, we didn't know who we could put on the bench, who we couldn't. We, obviously, we've got a few injuries anyway. We've had to leave a couple behind. So we literally couldn't fin fill a bench. We were, probably, we were too short from filling a bench. So we had to name them, but they're actually on a bed in the changing room.